You are now listening to About That Business, hosted by Rom Wills. Rom Wills is an entrepreneur and personal coach who has helped people reach their fullest potential personally and professionally. Take it away, Rom. Welcome to Rom Wills About That Business. Keep track of every single business expense and the business people who are already in there should know that because this 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 tax time now <laughs> you gotta fill that out and that's a very important thing when you're putting out a uh, doing some type of business you going i mean in most cases you gotta put out something something you gotta pay for something even if you're providing a service you might need uh say you're an auto detailer you might be independent don't have your own spot you still gotta buy the material for it right Put, write that down how much how much you do it or if you attract like say auto detail again and you travel to different spaces you do it on their property write down the mileage like if you use your vehicle for it like uh you know if uh how much how much electricity you think you're using at your home if you're working out your home everything every single thing that's related to your business you need to write that down and there's a whole lot. There's a whole lot because when uh whenever I do my taxes every year, I look at a lot of stuff that I'm not I'm not even using just because, for the simple reason that's not a part of my business. But that means there's a whole lot because you know yeah if you look at the form and everything the tax form yeah you haven't done every single thing, but here's the thing, something you've done and then something else. Then there's something else that you've done right. You've like probably have some extra stuff because on the tax form, they have extra stuff that might not be listed and they'll say it. That's usually where I put a lot of stuff. So it's always there. If you go on some place to travel, say, uh, all right, because one of the things I'll do is maybe go to a different city for a workshop, a special event. Shoot, I'm writing down a travel expense for that joint. <laughs> I'm writing down a travel expense. Now, you also have to write down what you make. But here's the thing. When you do that, it adds up a lot. It adds up a lot, and that's something you can write off on your taxes. It gives you a little bit extra. And in fact, sometimes, I'm going to be honest, sometimes when you first getting started, like say you have a side business, right? That can actually help with it, especially if uh, you start off as a sole proprietor. Most people start off with an LLC, and that's a, oh, that's a very, is 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 a good thing if you just start now but then i mean um i meant to say it's a good thing maybe starting out as a sole proprietor at first and this is and especially write stuff off then but then um as you grow definitely the llc because then you don't have to uh you know get anything mixed up keeping everything separate but you know writing it off every little bit if you paying somebody right even if you pay somebody if it's over six hundred dollars, you can actually uh, write that off too. Well, you can write off anything you pay somebody, but it's, uh, one thing if it's over six hundred, technically you're supposed to, uh, you know, give them a ten ninety nine. But you still, if you pay somebody, pay for services, you can write that off. Every single thing, if you having a lunch with somebody, a business client, you can write that off, and you know. You seriously, you can go through it. In fact, maybe look up some stuff online about what you can write off, what you can't write off. And if you can do it specifically, specifically for the business you're in, because, you know, I know what I can write off and not write off, uh, you know, doing what I do now. But I mean, just to be real, I don't know every single business because I haven't worked in every single business. So the important thing to do, regardless of the business you in, look it up. I mean, Google is your friend. Google is your friend. Look it up. You know, you might be able to write off. If you could, I always use the example of a massage therapist. You might be able to write off the cleaning fees for the sheets you use. <laughs> you know, whatever you got. See, understand that. And, you know, keep off, keep track of everything. Every single receipt, every single thing. Like I, uh, when I'm mailing books out, oh, I got... Uh, a big old envelope just to stick them in. <laughs> now, do something, uh, keep them, try to keep them organized in there because I did it a year. I always got to go through it, <laughs> organize it because I'll just, you know, I'll be in a hurry just sticking them in. But whatever the case, that receipt is right there and I'm definitely going to use it. See, that's the important thing. Always, always keep that in mind. Just, you know, you got supplies. 
you know, especially for especially in businesses where you got to mail out stuff, you know. What did you have to pay to this company to get it? Like this one company I uh, paid for with like my book mailing um, packages, uh, cardboard. It is a special thing just to mail books. <laughs> Keep the receipt for that. You know, whatever little bit you had to pay. Travel expenses, you know. Keep that down if it's strictly for business. And, you know, one of the things is always keep in mind business. business. What did it do with, with business? You know, meeting, like gas mileage, everything. How much gas you had to put to drive to this particular place? A lot of people do that. But keep track of it. And it may seem... Uh, the reason I'm even sharing that, sometimes it's not obvious to people, believe it or not. There's a lot of smaller business people, you know, they're making their money, but they don't keep track of their stuff good. And it's like, look, no, 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 you spent that money. So it's like, instead of giving that money to Uncle Sam, shoot, Uncle Sam is like, okay, you spent that money, boom, we ain't going to bother you about it. So anyway, keep track of it. It's very important. It's... it's like one of the things in business, sometimes you you gotta sweat the details. You gotta sweat the details. So anyway, that's all I have for today. Let's go make that money. Oh.